Hello everyone, welcome back! So as you can see, I'm already in-game, I've just obviously got it paused. I have not done anything since um, last time, so it's literally at the exact same point that we left. I literally just loaded in a few moments ago and then paused it, just so then we don't have to be waiting for the loading screen to end before we can actually start. Um, so there's no particular plan for today, probably just working on the house, um, taming a few more dinos. You know, basic arc stuff. Maybe do a little bit more exploring. That would be nice. Uh, I do, however, have some music for today because last time, obviously, the arc music kept just stopping randomly, so we didn't get nice music all the time. So I'm going to play some of my music, just you know, the regular stuff you probably heard before if you tune into my streams regularly. Hopefully, it's not too loud or too quiet. Let me know if you guys can hear it all right. That's in the right volume, but let me know if you guys can actually hear it or not, because sometimes you guys actually, turns out, even though I can hear something quite loudly, you guys can't. Um, I think it's just the way that it goes through. But yeah. Well, the game is lagging a little bit, mainly because I just loaded in, so it'll take a few moments for it to fully load. Um, yeah, I have, um, instead of having the dodo decks and stuff open another tab on my computer i've actually got the dodo decks app open today so hopefully it'll be a bit easier for me to find things because uh, i did notice um i not that i really need to use it last time but for some reason the website version doesn't easily have the uh, specifically the fjordia map dinos separately on the app it's fine but the website doesn't seem to, but I'll also have to like look up on the website thing for the resource maps of stuff when we actually get around to doing that, which might not be today. Um, yeah, as it's night time at the moment, we can't really do anything. Apparently these haven't loaded in properly yet. Um, but, and I'm out of food. Um, did I put some in here? Oh good, we were cooking some food, that's nice. Eh, I'll chuck that stuff in there as well. Oh, okay. Didn't let me just drag it. So I think food's going to be an issue. And then we've also got the issue of heat at least during the night, which is why we have to stay near the fire. Can't go off exploring. Where are all my dialos? Where, where the hell are they all? Oh, we had to leave them somewhere, didn't we? Because it was getting night and we were freezing to death. Where did we leave them? Can anyone remember? Because I can't. It's been so long. Um, probably good to just put that out for now. Hopefully we won't start freezing again. Alright, where were the dialos? Um, were they down there? Is that where we left them? I know we were down there at some point. Can't see them. If anyone watching starts noticing my health go down randomly and I don't pay attention to it, shout at me in the chat. Because I do not pay attention to my health, my hunger, my thirst. If anyone notices any of those going down, just yell. Because I, it will probably save me if I am not paying attention. Where are they? I 
I'm assuming somewhere down here because this is where we were. This is usually the path we take to get back up. But I can't remember way, which way we'd gone. Ha ha! There they are! There's two. I swear we had more than two. Oh no, there's another one. They all got stuck. Any more? There's three dilos. I swear we had more than three. We need a better way of getting back up to our base. Maybe going this way along the beach, we can find a slope up where we don't have to cross the river. Not that it's a problem to do that. We checked this way last time, didn't we? We probably have to just make like a ramp up. Yeah, it's like a cliff all the way over there. It's just quicker to go the other way. My parasaur is faster than the dilos, so I have to wait for them to catch up. I was like, what's that? It was just the light glistening off the pterodactyl a bit weirdly. It like, looked like something weird. Just grab some berries in the bushes as I go. I'm going to go down the tree. It's one that's slightly in the way. Which one is it? That one. I can never remember which one I have for the group ones. I think it's you and I. You is the one I pressed just then. Um, but I can never remember. That over there. So food is a bit of an issue at the moment. We need more food. Actually, do these dilos have more any meat on them? Yes. Not much, but that's fine. Okay. 
Yeah, just give them all a little bit. Don't want them starving. There we go. Right, what does the parasol have in its inventory? Oh yeah, that stuff. Movement speed. Sure, I'll take that stuff. And then the berries and things go in here. Remembering how I had everything organised before. Keep some of this stuff. Yeah, that can go in there. Yeah, a bit of flint. Yeah, we don't need all of that. A bit of stone. A little bit of wood. things. That in there. Yeah, that's a bunch of the basic materials. Take that with me. Take that with me. I'll give, put those berries in there. ones of those because those are always useful. Uh, nothing in here I think I'll need. Yeah should be good for now. Unless those shoes are broken. Nah I'm good. Just keep petting that guy to level everyone up around here. So I think what we want to do is maybe get a pteranodon so we can fly places. Uh, which does mean I'm going to need a bowler. I don't already have one, do I? Okay, so what do I need? Oh, I can make a few. Only one. What am I missing? Need more fiber. Let's make five of them. They're always useful. Then the next thing we're going to need is some meat. Is trandons eat meat? So we need to use that for taming. And just generally it'll be a good idea to have some for eating as well. And then I think I'd like to make some narcotic arrows. Because it makes taming things a lot easier. So I should put this down. Let's just go pop it down over here for now. I can always make a new one. What was it to make narcotics? Narcoberries and small meat. My sensitivity is a little high. I keep like spinning way further than I intend to. And spoiled meat. There we go. Oh, wait, is this some regular meat in there? Why would I drop that in there? Probably by accident. Take out that piece. How many narcotics we can make. Probably not many. 18, yeah. Which is fine. We'll at least have some.
I can just leave that crafting whilst I go do other things. I'm going to put this out for now. Keep that as bare stuff to tame with. Not letting me access the inventory. Come on. There you go. Uh, I'm going to leave the narcotics there. I won't take them with me for now. Why are you climbing on my house? Right. I should remember to equip these. Which is a more open area so it makes sense to come down here. Can actually see all, all the things. There's a trend on. Things I can only hit it with the bowler when it's on the ground. Hoping that one was about to land, but apparently I scared it off. Those little bird things are so annoying. Don't want them stealing my stuff. I just realise I don't have very many stones for my slingshot. are party dodos so no point hurting them because they don't give me I don't think I think they give the cake There we are. Then we just keep an eye on it. What are you sit on? Neutral. I don't know over there that I think I'm going to get. Come on.
दे दूंगा Why does my screen have to shake when I'm doing this? Nah. Or is that the same one? No, there's others over there. I'll leave it. Oh, and damn, I don't have any meat for this guy. Let's check on the trend on. Still unconscious, but hasn't eaten anything. Okay. Too fast. And those guys are getting it now. Let me kill you so I can eat, use your meat. There we go. Where's my parasol? Right there. For fuck's sake! Kill that thing. The problem is these things are so hard to hit. Come back power, so it's flown off. Why do you not have food in his inventory? That's not what I meant, that one. He did have food in his inventory. And he was taming. Don't know what happened. are not easy to tame. They do wake up fairly quickly. I know I probably don't have access to the saddle yet, but I will then have him. Yeah, I need the level 38. What level am I at currently? Oh, 
25. Hold up. Um, I think more fortitude seems kind of essential with how cold it is at night times here. Taming thing. Damn it. You guys wait here. things over there I wonder. Thought I'd have a look in the water whilst I'm waiting around here. Oh, come on.
almost there. I shouldn't need to give it any more narco berries. I just remember a bit about this thing. <laughs> like I can literally see the stats in here. also need to follow me Okay, almost back. you to stop. Good, it landed in a good spot. Oops, wrong key. I always do that. Officer, what the hell are you doing? It's this way.
want to sort join the group and send back from them. There you go. Meat. Button. I'm constantly doing that, pressing the wrong button because I'm not really paying attention to exactly which one I'm pressing sometimes. Thinking I'm pressing the right one and then turns out I'm not. Rather than heading along the beach, I'm going to head inland a little bit. In fact, if I look at the map... Yeah, let's try and go inland a little bit, see what we find. Some metal rocks over here, that's nice for when we want to do some mining. There's already some we found. Wait, are these the same ones we found before? I think they might be. Some compies over there. You know what? Let's turn around. Compies. That is an Alfagano. We aren't going that way. I think it was an Alfagano. Oh yeah, this is the thing that we found before. And all of the rare flowers. Argentavis. Well, we know where there's some Argentavis is for when we want them. We'll eventually want to tame one. Ooh, there's a red thing over there. That's one of the Things. How do we get across? I can die. Leave me alone. Okay. 
also has a very large turning circle, so it makes it difficult to turn and fight things. There's a thing in the water there. Don't know what that is. Not tell. This was possible to cross over. Come on. There's a Kano down there. Am I now stuck? No, 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 don't walk that way. That's the edge. Like, surely I should be able to step up there. You stay here because I don't want you accidentally falling down. Should be able to jump up that little bit. There we go. go with more fortitude because why not let's see what's down this way I think it's all just like a cliff and see if I can see all that thing that was just in the water over here Mesopithecus. Okay. Looks to be trapped. I wonder if I can tame it. Just having a look. Um, Pithicus. There we go. Medjo berries. So I need to knock it out. Well, I can do that, I think. Damn it, swimming away. No, I killed it. Didn't mean to kill it.
Oh, come on. Okay, I have the stuff in my inventory to fix it. Are there any fish or anything in this water? I don't think I saw anything, but... Doesn't look like there's a way to get further up there from here. Might as well head back down. I think it was over here that we saw the Carno, so we don't want to go that way. Because we are not yet strong enough to fight a Carno. Wondering if it would be a good idea to try and tame uh, something in the water. Because obviously like we, we can get to a lot of places that way. But it's whether... That's a good idea to try and do now. Might have a look, see what there is around. I suppose I should just walk down rather than taking the parasol and leaving it on the beach. Dinos are up there, just in case we need to call them down for help. Okay, so there's some non-hostile ones around. It's a good sign.
I want to tame one of those guys. Um, let me see how those can be tamed. A Megachelon, a passive tame. Lure a small swarm of fish over to it. I think I'd need something else first to be able to swim like that. It's just stone. Keep an eye on my oxygen. That's just regular bush like thing. Where'd all the mega shamans go? There was like five of them there and they're all gone now. But we know they spawn here, so we can get some in the future. It also looks like there is nothing else dangerous around here for now. Oh, come on. Don't do that whilst low on oxygen. Damn it, I don't have any wood. Need to head out the water so I can get some wood so I can repair my spear, or rather make a new one. Get myself some fish. Because most of the aquatic Dinos need fish to tame, I think. Let's make a few of them. They do stack, so when one breaks, we will have spares. <laughs> I need to start up, up in my oxygen if I want to be able to spend any length of time underwater. Also, I don't like the vision distortion being underwater, it's so irritating. So I'm not seeing anything hostile down here, which is nice. At least nothing at the moment. What are these? They just I'm not good at remembering 
to get air. I think probably best I um, stop trying to be underwater right now. Because until I get my oxygen thing up, I'm I'm going to do that probably more than once. Also, I'm running out of stamina. to cook some of the meat because I'm going to need more. I swear my hunger is going down a lot faster than it usually does. Maybe that's because I'm constantly cold so it goes down quicker. That would make sense. But I don't know why this place is so cold. Like it would, ex it would be sensible for like that area that looks snowy to be cold. Let's check if my dialers or anything have any on me. We need to get warmer clothing, I think. Because we're constantly cold and that is not helping with anything. This is, will be a good idea. We need to, the smithy and stuff for that though. First stuff is probably what we should go with because of how cold it is. 
so we need like smithy for those but that'll probably be our best option yeah, that's going to be a bit of time before we can get that stuff anyway Gonna see if I can find that green supply drop and hope that I can actually get it. Hopefully there's nothing dangerous this way. Looks relatively safe around here. I think I might follow this path for a bit, see where it leads. splits off. Let's take a quick look down this way. This is going back towards the beach area. Ooh, look. The tech parasol, I think. Do I try and tame it? The tech ones are pretty cool. Level three. And what's this guy we've got? Level 13. I mean, it is a pretty one. There's a Dimorphodon over there. I like those ones. It's going in the water over there. all of the things are because I can't really see clearly. Oh, 
auf dem Dongay. Because I would like to tame one. It's a cute little shoulder pet. And they eat meat. Just looking it up on the dodo decks. Uh, right, where'd it go? Oh, I said it flying off over there. Great. What's that down there? Little monkeys. Um, whatever that we saw earlier. Um, Mesopithecus. So this one, the Mesopithecus is actually a passive tame <laughs> when I looked at the other thing, but for some reason it wasn't showing up saying it was a passive tame initially, um, which is weird. Is it safe to go down there? Is there any other dangerous stuff? I don't think so. So what I want to do, I'm assuming with most passive tames, right, I'm going to move these over so I can keep the midget berries in that slot. Fucking compies. of course hide in the bushes and I can't see them any more yeah I think that's all of them well free meat Is there another one there? I don't know, let's keep that in my hands just in case there's more compies. Right, where's the little monkey? Let's have a look, see if anyone says... Damn it, they ran off. Okay, there's one in the water and one over there. I 
that's the problem with these guys. They run. Is it coming towards me? So close. It just keeps going down. Why isn't it? It hasn't taken the last two berries off of me. Fuck, is it in the water? Idiot. I ain't going in the water. Come on, get that thing off my screen. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't know what that thing over there is. Whether it's hostile or not. See, now that's all the way over there. Great. Annoying. Would it even be safe for me to go in the water? Fuck no. The answer is no. Yeah, yeah passive. Come out of the water parasol. That mess of physics is back. My guy is very near the mess with the so I don't want to go near it. Yep, it's hostile. 
thought it was. Fuck, I'm dead. My first death. I knew that thing was hostile. Well, I didn't know, but I, I thought it was. Oh, that's annoying. It didn't initially seem like it was going to attack me as well. I just see like my bed is so far away. Well, I lost my parasol and all my stuff. Come on, I want all of these guys. Are they following? Good. I'm going to hope that these guys together can kill the thing. Even my base walking is too quick for these guys, apparently. There's some little compies over there. was that one. Where did that come before me please? Fucker, don't attack me. Did they kill the other one? Come on. Why did they stop following me? Oh, maybe it was when I told them to accidentally to go to a point. Maybe that stops them following me. And of course, I am very cold.
Dilophosaur. It's gonna attack me. Help my Dilophosaurus! Kill the other one! Thank you. I'm gonna see if I can tame this guy. He's just run away. I'm gonna ignore that. Did you guys eat the body? No, they didn't. Nice. And I can ride him! In this case you don't need a saddle to ride. That's awesome. It's not that quick though. This. Probably need like an axe or something. Yep, that thing is still there. Guarding my body. Come on. It's moving away. Let's see if we can go around. I need to find the bag from the parasol. Oh. Or just the parasol. Um, take those bits. Leave the rest. Put all my clothes back on. Where's my hat? That's just the skin for it. Not oh, there. Oh yeah, and I can drop spare ones of these. Yeah, I might keep that one. Oh. Just drop it, I think, yeah. Well, let's try and tame this parasaur over here. You know, seeing as we no longer have one. Didn't want them to attack.
Oh, I just realised I was eating the wrong thing. And I do not have any water. As soon as this guy's tamed, we're going to the water. Nice. Saddle and that. And you can also have those berries. Oh yeah, the parasol is rather injured. We should eat some berries. need to keep running so it doesn't kill me again. I did not realise that's what it what that was. I thought it was something else. Yep. Entirely expected. I am abandoning them. Otherwise, we've escaped. This little compy is annoying. Not attacking, though. actually. I wasn't sure whether they could be tamed or not. Gotta look it up. Yes, they can be tamed with mutton, prime meat and prime fish meat. That is the only stuff that they can be tamed with. So... not freezing to death so that's fine. I am gonna however hop off the parasol and drink some water. It's not letting me There we go. Made me like step in the water properly. Let me get back on the parasol. And then we should be fine to head home. Well, we lost one Dilophosaur. Which isn't bad. Well, and the parasol earlier, but...
Ich lasse Digital Officer. Oh no. Got three. One was just hidden behind the moss shops. And all the names blend together. There we go. Then drop off some of this stuff. Uh, all of that can go in there. Don't need anywhere near this much stuff in our inventory. Don't need that out, as soon as we've got this fire. There we go. So that thing that killed us, are they tameable? Oh yeah, they are. You have to be wearing a ghillie suit and use giant bee honey. So not something I'm likely to tame anytime soon. Probably gonna need to look at actually building the house and then like setting up like the forge and the smithy soon. Because those will be very useful. What other bits and pieces should we learn? We've got quite a few engrams. Actually, what were those ones that were in here? So we've got the recipe for medium crop plot, raptor saddle and wooden door frame. I think probably build everything like the walls and stuff out of wood. Makes sense we've got like that blueprint as well as like a few other wooden bits. Gonna need that. This would pr 
probably be useful for light wires. Um, so it's the door frame that we had, so we'll need the wall and the door. Although getting the door gets us toward well, the door frame anyway, but that's fine. What else are we going to need? I'm going to want a raft at some point, so I might as well learn it now. The pipe stuff isn't going to be super useful because it's not far to get water. Both of these are going to be needed. probably want to do stone foundations actually because they're like a nice foundation I quite like using. And stone stairs. I'll go with the triangle foundations as well just in case I need to use those. That's all I think now, for now. We're gonna not need a staircase because I think we'll just do one level for now. I'm gonna get in that one just so it's like to get around the edges. Okay, so. Let me All the view. Makes it easier. Stone. Yeah, this is fiber hide and wood. Oh, that's annoying that like some of the things aren't together. Yeah, I'll just look at it in this view, it's fine. So basically we need a hell of a lot of stone to switch all the foundations, but we'll do that over time. We'll start with putting in like walls and stuff. So Actually, do we want the small door frame? I prefer the big doors. They're easier to get through. What part of this are we going to have as indoor? I think I might want to extend some of this out. I don't have the materials to make any more thatch foundations just to see. Just to see where I can build them to. Let's 
see along here I can extend them out at least by one is it on the whole section or yep all along here potentially further uh, yep I can do some more on this side oh yeah it's when they get to the end that this is just too much of a low bit I can keep going that way all the way along or do I need to make even more thatch foundations just to like test some out thatch I only one more but that's fine Can go even further out this way. Or do I even want to? I'll just pop that there for now. So, in terms of the little building section, which we can always change later. I think we should have at least like three. So perhaps here. And then what, like three there? three there let's go with two instead then because we can't build any further out this way in a full line because what they don't place there so we need at least two that way And then we'll build it, what, one, two more. It's a decent size. And then build, like, some this way. Doesn't have to be an exact square or anything. Although, to be fair, we can build that side out more, so... Yeah, and this is enough space for most of the dinos to, like, walk around. Let's just turn this fire off for now actually. Oh no, it's almost done. Let's it I'll let it finish. Let it finish the last two bits of meat before turning it off. So, to make more walls, we're going to need probably more wood. Don't know why I've run out of there. Ah, fibre. Why 
I dump those in there for now. I'm gonna go grab more wood. Then I can craft some more stuff. I would like some more foundations as well. And we're going to expand the area as big as I can like make it, keeping it sort of squarish, rectangle-ish. Check that in the inventory. Check some of this stuff away so I can actually move. I'm going to take this guy over to the trees so I can load him up on wood once I've filled up my inventory.
uh, that might be enough, at least for now. I'm probably out of fiber, aren't I? Uh, I can't remember if I took all of it out of the chest or not. Wait for these to finish, then go double check. Otherwise, I'm going to use my moss chops to gather fiber because it's apparently really good at that. Oh good, there is still some in here. Oh, and some wood. Yeah, you can stay here for now. Eh, actually no. You can follow. Okay, apparently he can't get up there. Oh, he's encumbered. Right, so I've come a bit closer. I want to offload some of his inventory to you. Or not. Both of you follow me back. Apparently the mosh-ups can't climb up there. Never mind. Come around this way. Mosh-ups, why aren't you moving?
let's pop the berries oh and that in here make some more of that just constantly make it as much as I can that's the only use the rotten meat has Let's not do like 30 of them. I don't know whether I'll need that many, but 15 seems like a reasonable number. I'm gonna need at least one of these and one of these. I'll probably need more, but for now that's all I'm gonna use. We just have to wait for everything to craft. Too encumbered to move. I still can't move. Do not need to click that guy. Yeah, take these. Oh, please, I can move now. No. Okay, this as well. Okay, I should be able to move now. There we go. as far out that way as I can go. You stay there. Oh, and I can't go any further this way. Ah, oh, maybe because the rock's in the way? I'll go there. Mm-hmm. 
Looking good, I think. See so yeah, a too wide area around the edge. And then over here, basically, they'll just I'll just do like ramps down. And this can be like an area that I just leave. Freezing. Great. So how many do I want to leave on this side? So I probably don't need to make it as big as the area is. And I was thinking of like having this area down here, sort of where I am, is like a dino area. So maybe leave some more platform to have other dinos parked on, basically. So how wide is it? It's one, two, three, four, five wide. So maybe do it as square and do five by five. Seems reasonable. I'm still losing health. Almost stood inside the fire. Any closer, and I will be burning myself. Why is my health going down? I don't know whether having this on is helping as much. Okay, that was helping a bit. It's not even night time and I'm freezing. We really need to make this house. Okay, I've got four, so I need five, six, seven more wood walls. And then, how am I going to do the ceiling? Yeah, my house going back up now. Okay, what ceiling options? I think probably sloped that roof. And I suppose I think do it similar to how I did it before. But rather than doing a second level, just do a ceiling. Probably will work best. I wonder if I can hold the parasol from over here. There you go. See if we can figure out how to get over here.
So I need seven of these. Also gonna need the sloped wall, I think. I don't think I actually have enough wood walls. I think I need another six more. Which means I need more wood, probably. Actually, no. Five more. Because I've got the door to put in somewhere. First, I'll need the slip walls. I don't start freezing the moon when I go away from that. Yeah, that is now five, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Okay. So you cannot come in here. Stop. for this side. In case anyone's curious how, how I'm telling which way around to put them, one side is like sort of a greeny outline and one is more of a bluey outline. Like um, this, 
sides colors when you're trying to place them. Luckily there is the pickup option if they do place wrong, but... Sometimes getting the stuff to place in the right way is difficult in this game. If you've watched any of my previous arc, you know how much difficulty I found getting some of it to work and actually going where I wanted it. Okay, it's not going to let me place any of that. I wasn't sure whether it would or not unless I've got the walls in. So I need another five wood walls. But I do not have enough wood. Uh, I have enough of everything else though. So we're going to go and get some more wood. Go to these trees over here. And whilst I'm here, I should get some water. There we go. Even though I don't really use that like water thing, I might as well fill it up. To be honest, that's probably enough. I'll finish destroying this tree. Again. Can't be us spend ages chopping down trees. Exactly enough.
There we go. We have a house. Not the nicest house, but... Can we move this? Let's just demolish it and rebuild. Oh, I didn't quite get back enough materials. Never mind, we'll just go grab some off the parasol. I think it was just that stuff that I was missing. Here we go. Uh, right, let's get rid of all of the stuff over here. Uh, you know what, I might just leave this, but I'll just make a new campfire inside. And I think for now I might just leave the storage is out here as well, and at some point maybe off stream, move everything in, sort it all out. Let's put this right in the centre. I'm going to take the wood out of this one though, or at least most of it. Leave a little bit in there in case I need it. This should basically mean I stay warmer. Because I believe that's what that means. That I've got like a Shelter. Theoretically closing that door should mean I'm quite warm. Those bits. Actually, no, those don't go in there. Like that. Oops, not that one. Actually, I should keep those things on me, shouldn't I? Uh, some of this. Only hot for that, I think. Uh, fiber. To be fair, I don't even need 70 thatch, I can just look some more that way. Take that. Uh, a little bit of wood, which I don't have. Oh, yeah, I used it all, didn't I? Or rather, a lot of it's in the campfires. I'll probably just go quickly grab some more from a tree or something. I think that's everything I need from in there. Just wood that I need, so let's go grab a little bit of that. Don't need much, so let's grab this little tree. Where 
already. Good thing I've got the repair materials. Got a lot more wood from that than I was expecting. Up on the thing. enough to have on me. That's all the spare stuff I need and I'm cold again. Of course. But if I go in here, am I warm? Yeah, it's warm enough in here that I should probably don't have to worry. Which is nice. Because once I've moved all the stuff in here, I will do like most of my crafting and stuff in here. Um, let's eat that. Okay, so what is the next thing we need to work on? Um, cooking pot probably soon, maybe. Um, but probably the forge is a good idea to do s well the forge and the smithy so we can get some of the other tools that are going to be useful because then we'll be able to like get the stuff to make the fur clothing and hopefully we won't have to worry about getting cold again I don't believe these have that much insulation only 15. What's the stuff we're currently wearing? Yeah, it's not that good. Um, but the first stuff. Pretty good insulation. 65 compared to the like 15 and 8 so that'll be good to keep us nice and warm but obviously we need metal and pelt hair or wool it'll probably be pelt or hair um, we've had a few levels up since we last looked through oh the sickle uh, but we've got the moss chops to get a decent amount of stuff now, so I might not worry about that right now. Um, don't think there's anything else we need to worry about right now. Uh, oh, let's re-equip that there. Always useful. Okay, I think I am going to end the stream there for the day because I can't really think of what else to work on now. It's really just like exploring, taming things, gathering materials. So I'll probably like do a little bit of planning off stream of like, okay, let's do this and this and this so I ha actually know what I'm going to work on and maybe do a little bit of like gathering off stream if I, th if I remember. Like, but like with between the last stream and this one, I did nothing on this because I was very busy doing other things. So we'll see. I'm going to try and do this like once a week at least, of like streaming it. But we'll see if that happens because I'm not really doing much, like just working on gathering materials and like building stuff. It might not be as entertaining to stream or I might just not feel like playing. Um, but yeah. I'm going over to this screen whilst I exit out of the game. And then in a moment, 
We will have a look for someone to raid. Let's see. Um, okay, there's a few people live. What's everyone doing? I need to wait for the ad to end so I can see what this one is, but... Which, like, some of the other people, I don't like raiding as much. Um, and then others like, yeah, they're not playing something I want to raid into, or I've raided them recently. Just need to wait for this ad to end. It's somehow a really long one. Okay, don't know what that is, so not sure. Um, let's read this person then. Hey, okay, I'm gonna send you guys over to Sean Bean. He is currently playing Satisfactory. So yeah, I will send you guys over there and if you have a good time there with him. Um, yeah, and head on over there and just like post some love in the chat if you feel like it. If not, don't worry about it and just, yeah, have a nice time. Yeah, I hope you all have had a nice time here in my stream today. A nice chill arc. Well, chill except when we were dying, obviously. But, you know, that only happened once. Um, so that's fine. And we got all of our stuff back, so that's all right. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for hanging out and watching everyone. Hope you all have had a nice time here today. And I will see you all next time. Bye bye.